They're a bold option for people looking to go a bit wild with their home decor. Large, colorful animals made of paper mache. Inanimate, exotic pets that make quite the conversation piece. Sold in galleries or upscale design boutiques, each creature is a unique work painted by an artist. These large-scale paper mache animals are handcrafted by artisans in Tonala, Mexico, a town renowned for colorful decorative arts. They cast the animal shape in plaster and fiberglass molds. There's a two-part mold for each of the animal's main body parts. The artisans dampen pieces of recycled cardboard, then glue them onto the walls of the mold cavity. They continue until they fully lined the cavity five layers thick, three layers if it's a small-sized animal. Then they close the mold and set it aside to dry, which, depending on the size, takes from three to six days. Then they open the mold and extract what is now a hollow cardboard shell of the body part. They assemble the animal by adhering all the body part shells, reinforcing the joints with strips of newspaper. Then they paper over the entire surface to even it out. The paper dries in 3 to 12 hours, depending on the size of the animal. Next, they mix together talc, water, glue, and wet cardboard. This recipe produces a thick adhesive paste, which they spread evenly over the entire animal. The paste takes about 40 minutes to dry and harden. Then they apply a second coat. When that dries, they water down the paste to a thin runny consistency and apply a third coat. Once that dries, they send the animal to the detailing department. There, using the thick paste, artists sculpt and apply raised body and facial features. Once the paste detailing dries, they sand the entire animal to prep for painting. In the art department, they first apply a primer coat, white or beige. This seals the surface. Once the primer is dry, they paint the animal's background color. Now the true artistry begins. Using watercolors, artists make the animals come alive with expressive eyes and fanciful features. No stencils or predetermined designs. The artists follow their imagination and create a unique work of art. The last step, four coats of transparent lacquer in either a high gloss or matte finish. The lacquer dries hard as a rock, forming an impenetrable protective layer over the paint. The paper mache surface is now durable and moisture resistant. These handcrafted animals are sought after by collectors around the world, which might explain why it's a jungle out there. <laughs>